kind of day to day, I could be doing anything from attending marketing meetings to uh, I, I was just in tech rehearsal for New York, New York, and watching everything come together and being a support. Um, sometimes I'm. Uh, I'll do really anything if it means that I, I should get coffee for folks because no one else is there to do that and um, I'm like the least important person in the room in that moment, I'm happy to do that. If it means that I'm sitting there with the creative team talking about notes on the show, I, those are amazing moments. I feel so privileged to be there. Um, a lot of my time is also supporting uh, Tom, my boss, he's really incredible on uh, the financial parts of the money raising and so it is a lot of talking to investors and co-producers and encouraging everyone and giving them the information they need to be able to either make an investment themselves or raise the money and support the show and be an ambassador for our show. Um, I will say that uh, I've gotten the chance to be really close to that now and I'm very proud that I've been able to help raise the money and, and do a large part, like millions of dollars is really what we're talking about on Broadway. I did cry like three times in the process. It was not easy um, and I, I knew I had an instinct for selling and like I would sell yearbook ads when I was a kid for like a thousand dollars. I don't know why anyone buys them for a thousand but they did. Um, but. And I thought, oh, this will be this will be an extension of that, and it was, but it was so much harder than I thought. And it's all based on relationships. Like that's probably going to be the theme of this conversation: <laughs> is that relationships are really important in this industry, and who you meet and how you treat people is really important.